Good morning. Today I will be taking the ICE train from Dusseldorf to Utrecht and I will be riding in first class today for the first time. So let's go check that out. My train leaves are like 11.08 I think and I have about an hour for my train leaves. I don't know why I got here so early, I don't know. I think there's a lounge that I can check out so let's go look for that. I've had a nice time here in Germany but as much as I've enjoyed it I'm really excited for this train ride. Know you're early when your train's not even on the board. Oops. I'm now on a mission to find the first class lounge. I've never been to a train lounge before, so I'm intrigued as to what it's gonna look like. Walking through the terminal, I can't really find it. I just kept on walking all the way to the end until I saw this sign. So the lounge is all the way in the other side of the station, outside. It's kind of strange. I think I see the situation right now. I was about to say, I have no idea what to expect. Well, now I can see what to expect. There is no lounge. Well, that's not entirely true because there is a lounge. It's just currently being renovated. I guess it would be nice to know that up front, maybe get a bit of a discount or something. I'm not sure how it works entirely, but a little heads up would be nice. Great, now I have a lot of time to kill. My plan was to go to the lounge, so... I guess I'm gonna chill in the terminal. I mean, in the station which is not the prettiest of stations, by the way. This guy's having a cool dance off. Good for him. This is not exactly the lounge I was hoping for. It's a Starbucks. Also, I don't drink coffee, but I just wanted to try it today. I don't know why. The story is that I don't like coffee, but I really do want to like coffee. So every once in a while, when I'm in a mood, I try it out again and pray that for some reason I'll like it. I never do, but I try. Cheers. Oh, I can't drink though. So gross. I have a very big dilemma. I don't like the coffee, but I don't want to leave it here because they're going to think that I just don't like them. You know what I mean? I feel really bad. I had to ditch the coffee. What is this? Okay, let me go find. Now I'm really early. Let me go find my platform. My train will be leaving from platform 18, just as it says on the application. I have a while to wait, but thanks to this awesome sign, I'm able to wait on the correct area of the platform, right in front of where my carriage will stop. I'm in the first carriage, so that's fun. Or I'm in the last carriage, because I don't know which way the train's going. I just thought about that. Hopefully I'm in the first one. Okay, I'm in the seat. This time I got a window, like I asked for. I thought this seat would be a bit bigger. Maybe it's just me. Okay, it kind of seems like the one from second class. But I do love this. There's way more space. There's way more um, leg room as well. And it's less crowded. Also, I'm driving backwards and I hate that. Now that I'm seated, let's check out the seat. There's a small trash can on the right side, right next to the footrest, which, by the way, can move into many different positions and the footrest is always a plus. The seat is comfortable, but I can't tell if there really is a bigger difference when comparing to second class. The table is great, it has lots of space, you can do lots of work on it and have a glass of water next to it as well. Overall, like I said when I took second class, the train really needs an update and I've heard that it is getting one quite soon. In 2026, the Deutsche Bahn will be launching new trains on their international routes, and I'm excited for that. Now, let's talk Wi-Fi. There is Wi-Fi on board, which is great. It was pretty easy to log in, but I have to be honest, the Wi-Fi was trash. After filming this, I had a FaceTime call and it kept cutting out. Maybe it was because I was traveling between countries, but nah, I think it was just the Wi-Fi. Okay, we are on our way. The first class seating spans the first two carriages, and I'm pretty sure I just found my favorite spot on the train. Okay, I've decided that this is where you want to sit, but I think this is just like a little lounge area that you can come in first class and you're supposed to be quiet but the guy behind me is watching videos so it's fine so if you sit here you can like kind of watch with the 
train driver. Sorry, I'm laughing because last time I messed up the name. I called him a pilot or something. Some guy did come and ask me if I wanted like coffee or something. But as you guys know, I don't like coffee. I did a bathroom tour when I came to Germany in second class. Let's do a bathroom tour here. I assume it's gonna be the same bathroom. You never know, let's check it out. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Ow. Conclusion, it's the same bathroom. We can do a quick rundown, but if you want a really good description. I already did the bathroom tour a couple videos ago. Quick rundown, it's a good bathroom, it's kind of airplane size. There's no art like we have in the Netherlands, so I kind of miss that. It's a good bathroom. Let's go back to my seat for the 40th time. I don't want to be in my seat. It's like, I'm on a train, I don't want to sit down. I want to go walk around. Okay, I can officially take my mask off. We are now crossing the Dutch border and the Dutch are hippies, so no masks. <laughs> so this is a quiet zone. That's part of first class, so I can sit here if I want to, I guess, that's the gig. Oh. I really hit my toe. Oh. See, before I was sitting there in my seat and I was thinking, what is the benefit of first class? Now I see it. But then I have this area to chill, I have the air in the front of the train to chill, there's another room there that's occupied, there's a room back here that's empty. This is a quiet zone, sorry. If there would be someone here, I would be respectful. Also, if you're six people, screw the quiet zone, close the door. Six of you, gonna go play a game of cards or something. I mean, I don't have friends, but it could be fun. See, you can have like a, you can have a feast. Bro, look at this. Ugh. You can have a whole picnic on the train. Anyway, let me go. I don't wanna occupy the, the quiet zone for too long. Okay, here's the food cart zone. So there's a cool area to just chill and stand, but there's also a place to eat. The bar is here. Honestly, good vibes. I'm having really good vibes. Okay, now I'm just gonna sit down and enjoy the ride. If I have any updates, I'll see you then. My only update is that I really enjoyed the ride. I enjoyed it so much that it went by much faster than my trip to Germany. We are now entering Utrecht Central, which is my stop for today. Okay, I've made it to Utrecht. Now here's the thing, the train actually keeps on going to Amsterdam, which is where I live, but the center of Amsterdam is like on the opposite side of where I live in Amsterdam. So it's actually easier for me to get off here and take a different train to where I live, which leaves in about seven minutes, so I gotta go. Conclusion, I really enjoyed it. I almost fell asleep, so that's a good sign, but I don't know if I would get first class. I think first class is only beneficial if you travel for like two and a half hours, three hours long. My train ride was like an hour and 40 minutes, and then I don't know if it's worth it, but a train ride that's longer, it's definitely worth it. Anyway, peace out, hope you liked the video. I gotta go catch my train. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you the next time. Bye.